in the fast paced world of technology some relics of the past linger on reminding us of the evolution of computing windows 98 is a 9x operating system that is used in the late 90s windows 98 ended support in 2006 because of that microsoft and application no longer support security updates and features if there's called kernel x we can run it so let's see the most of the application work without further ado let's get started first step updating internet explorer to version 6.0 a crucial task for ascending modern websites. Now, we just successfully installed Internet Explorer 6 on Windows 98 system. Let's test the Google.com on Windows 98. Okay, it loads, but we notice the browser interface is remaining an outdated image. And is from the early 2000s, despite attempting to access the modern website, we greet the user interface with a bygone area. Yep. The toolbar and navigation elements remain unchanged, displaying the signs of the old, older generation of web browsing. After encountering challenges with Internet Explorer 6, we decided to try installing Firefox 2 on our Windows 98 PC. Surprisingly, the installation process was successful, and we are eager to see how Firefox 2.0 performs. So as you can see, it's the one perfectly fine. So we, we made it to notice the outdated user interface diminished by the bygone area of web browsing. So it, the load the website looks load fine, but but we can manage to load Google.com, which is more improved UI compared to Windows Internet Explorer 6. So let's try web browsing Chrome download. So right, let's download Chrome the browsing in Google. It's fine, but it's well, it's kinda chunky, outdated, and loading to Chrome, as you can see, it's a broken web UI because it's a completely outdated website. Office XP release in 2001. It is completely compatible with Windows 98. Despite its age, it offers a smooth and normal editing experience compared to newer version. Back in the day, Fox used Microsoft Office XP on Windows 98. It wasn't fancy, but it got the job done for creating documents, spreadsheets, and presentations. But of course, technology marches on. Today's productivity suits offer a strategic array of features compared to Office XP. While Office XP serves its purpose, at my way did this its time, it's easy to see how these advancements have revolutionized the way we work. The ability to access and edit documents from anywhere, collaborate with colleges in real time, and utilize sophisticated formatting tools. These are luxuries that Office XP users wouldn't have dared to dream of. So while there's a certain charm to the simplicity of Office XP Windows 98, there's no denying the power and convenience that modern productivity suits bring to the table. They transfer document creation from a solitary task to a collaborative and dynamic process. So now, let's move on to the, to the kernel X of how the Firefox actually won the, the, late, the latest version, but the, not the latest, but the Firefox 52. It can run YouTube, let's find out. Today, we embark on a journey to bring modern browsing capabilities to the classic Windows 98 operating system using kernel X compatibility layer. Our goal 
Installing Firefox 52, the last version compatible with Windows 98, and witnessing its performance on this vintage platform. So did you know this? the last version because this uses Windows XP and Windows Vista to one of the latest version of Firefox that version 52 on XP so that it doesn't support anymore because Mozilla stopped receiving updates to Firefox in Windows XP and Vista so this is why we want kernel X like a Windows XP UI layer in Windows 98 as we delve deeper into the installation process of Firefox 52 in Windows 98 with kernel X we encountered a critical requirement Firefox and CC states certain Windows XP files and adjustment to add 99 files to function seamlessly. Right, so welcome back. So, so using Windows 98, the web browsing is not in support because all the browsers no longer works. So instead, I just make I just install kernel X, this is another version, and then I put some patches on Firefox, and now. Firefox in Windows 98 finally works. So, as you can see, it's completely work. So I can load you to my channel. Um, what the hell is this? You can load to my Google. Or I'm, or I, I can actually search it, but why not? Um, what the hell is this? And let's go to main YouTube. Yep, YouTube is still working. It's still loading up because this is this is very technically slow. Slow Windows 98. There you go. As you can see. So the font is not actually good because this is the older font and it doesn't support the So let's search my my channel. Right. Here's my channel. Yep. As you can see is completely functional YouTube here. Let's see it could be watchable today. So I will go to my videos. Yeah, like I see, as you can see, it's watchable S due to the slow performance. I don't know why. I don't know why. Why is Windows ninety eight very very slow? Yep, there you go. Right, loading video. I haven't clicked anything, but browser can play this video. But it could play the the animation video. So I think it is a watchable video. So your browser can play this video because of the codex. It doesn't support on this browser, so um, there's an error here, but. I don't care. But let me install ad another version of web browser, my pal. So let's see if this actually work. In this exploration of Windows 98 and its associated software, we journey to the annals of 
collecting history, uncovering both the nostalgia and practically of these vintage technologies. From the humble beginnings of Windows 98 to the challenges of navigating modern web with Internet Explorer 6, Office XP, and Firefox 52. So, this video is the enduring legacy of these iconic platforms. Despite its age, Windows 98 continued to cavitate answers this with its retro charm, simplicity, while its compatibility with modern software may be limited. The allure of experiencing computing from a bygone area remains unrestable. Internet Explorer 6 is the king of browsers now to serves as time when internet was through infancy. So because of that, Internet Explorer 6 has been no longer will be available and and then it will be move on to google modern web browsers so office xp is actually pretty good actually but well yeah it's kind of good i guess so firefox well kind of good except the codex doesn't support anymore and most of the web browsers looks perfectly fine but yeah it's completely works as a modern web browser but yeah same same performance as your x86 offering system so that's Windows 98 video, so thank you guys for watching, click the subscribe button, hit the bell button icon, hit the like and comment. Thank you and have you seen my next video. Till then, peace.